WTFNN. Headline News Update. Good afternoon, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of uh, partly cloudy Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 2 p.m. update. And as a 2 p.m. update, we've got a mixed bag out here. The mixed bag, as we'll see here momentarily, is the uh, Dow is trading up 117 points, while the S&P is off 5. The NASDAQ is off 51. The Russell's up 9. The semi's up 11. The trannies are up 1. So we've got the old mixed bag out here. You've got gold is up a buck 50. Silver down 15 cents. Lights we crude up 65 pennies. Natural gas up 29 cents. Let's go take a look at our index ETF or our ETF charts out here. So we'll begin by looking at, I've got to change panels out here, I believe we'll begin by taking a look in the upper left-hand corner of the QQQ chart. Here what we see is a TD nine count top, prices below the bottom of its profile, and that suggests that the Qs are making a move to the 368.79 level. That's the TD nine breakout area. The SPIs, the chart next to it, shows a TD nine count top, and price may be targeting its breakout level, 443.44. If that level fails, the next breakout area would be the target, 439.88. Let's keep going across on the upper right. The XLK, a TD9 count top, but price is still above the top of its daily profile, and that becomes the support area, 155.41. If price closes below that, 154.01 is the real strong support area that's the center of its profile, and that is the TD9 breakout level. The XLV, it uh, has a Rhodes momentum indicator top, and price right now is testing the bottom of its profile. If price closes below this level, around 132 and change out here, that would signal a move back to 127.64. Lower left, the Dow Jones Industrials via the diamonds. What do we have? We've got an inside day. An inside day typically signals that the trend that was in place prior to the inside day will continue. Well, that's a downtrend, and that could signal that the Dow Diamonds are targeting their breakout level of 338.68. The Russell 2000, a TD nine count top, price finding support right now at the bottom of its daily profile. The level to watch there is 220.75. You've got a hammer candle right now, and that would be a Gartley buy pattern uh, that would form if this were 4 p.m. It's not 4 p.m., but watch for that. The XLF just consolidated with inside its daily profile. The XLC, the communication sector for the S&P 500. Count top price may pull back to the 82 84 level. Folks, stay tuned for the power trading hour, and I'll see you back here tomorrow at one o'clock. Take care, have a great day. The reality is that navigating financial markets.